Hello everybody, welcome to our show. This is Brooklyn Beat with Joey and Freddie. Hello, today we're gonna to talk to you about a global epidemic. It's a pandemic. Excuses. Excuses. And you know who we're talking about. You got all the social media, you got Facebook. You got Twitter. You got LinkedIn. You got MySpace. You got MySpace? What are you talking about? What's this, 2005? You got everybody in their mother text messaging, checking in here for squaring. I look on Facebook, my grandma's checking in the Foxwoods at the slots. High roller. With all this social media, how much more social are we being visibly? How much more connected are we? Zip. Zip. Zilch. Nada. Zero. So today we're coming at you with some of the excuses we've been getting from our friends. Disclaimer. This is not a personal vendetta against any one of you. It's about all of you. I lost my phone. My text message didn't send to you, sorry. Since when do text messages not send, huh? How is it, explain to me, that your text messages only send when you need something? Ain't it the truth? Yeah, 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 I'll be at your brunch for sure. Yeah, the brunch is three weeks away. But I'm gonna be like an hour and a half, two hours late. We're only gonna be there an hour and a half, two hours. What are you talking about? I miss you, I never see you. Okay, so let's have dinner next week. Okay, but I can only come and stay for one drink because I got somewhere else to go. I didn't even tell you what day it was. I miss you, I never see you. Come to brunch this Saturday, $6, unlimited margaritas. Oh, I got no money. I'll spot you, it'll be like 15 bucks. Nah, I feel bad. Oh. Last minute invites are usually better for me or like months in advance, but nothing in between and then not too spontaneous because then it doesn't work out. I can't figure out my email. I know you already sent me the invitation, but what's the place called? And what time is it again? Where is it? And how do I get there? Oh, and this is the best. But what's when the best? Whenever anybody says this is the best, it's never really the best, because I mean, what's the best? All right, now this is the best. When your friend doesn't show up at all, and then like weeks later, they text you and they say, you're not gonna believe what happened to me that night. I don't even wanna know what happened to you unless you're dead, and then if you're dead, you couldn't be texting me right now, so you're not dead. No, the best, tell them what the best is. The best is when you're sitting there with all your friends having dinner and everybody's yapping about all the people who aren't there, the people that are late. Giving them the attention that they don't deserve. They don't deserve it. They don't deserve nothing. All right, calm down, calm down. You're gonna give yourself an ulcer. This video's making my blood boil! All right, before this guy has a heart attack, you all get the picture. Basically, if your friend invites you somewhere, you know what that means? They want you to be there. They don't want you to be late. They don't just want you to not show up. We're living in a world now where latenesses and no-shows and flakiness and shadiness, it's all getting tolerated, and it shouldn't be. We gotta make a 360. 365, no? Yeah, we gotta make a 365. What is this, a mouse or a spaceship? I thought it was a paperweight. Hey!